you know, I, I was, uh, I guess I was just going to let it go and, uh, you know, not saying anything to anybody or whatnot, but, uh, to the lady yesterday uh, at the Food Basics in Hespler, um, I'm not really sure, you know, why you felt the necessity uh, to make the comments that you did to me. Um, but something you need to understand is that uh, all handicaps um, are not really visible. Uh, I suffer from an autoimmune disease uh, called lupus, and. Uh, Essentially, my body's attacking itself and destroying its own cells, and uh, part of the uh, part of the daily uh, dealings that I go through every day is I'm in pain every day. Some days are are much worse than others. Um, some days I can barely walk. So my rheumatologist, a specialist, um, gave me a handicap parking pass for those days that. Uh, we're like yesterday, uh, days where I struggle with um, being able to walk. Uh, was I using my cane, which would have made you feel more comfortable? No, I wasn't. Um, but to refer to me as a fat pig and uh, make statements like you don't understand why doctors give cows like me... Um, a handicap parking pass while there's people in wheelchairs um, is pretty an, a, a pretty unfair statement. My wife and I um, will walk, uh, you know, for example, at the Costco in Burlington. I don't know how many times I've been there in pain, not excruciating pain, um, where there was no parking at the front of the building, but there was parking. Uh, in the handicap and I refused to use it because I wasn't having a very bad day that day and I had the ability to walk. Um, I don't use that parking pass unless I absolutely have to and uh, I do that out of respect for those that are wheelchair bound and uh, the elderly and whatnot but you know to make a statement like you did yesterday it it cut to the core because it, one of the most humiliating things I've had to do in my life, uh, first and foremost, was to admit to everybody that I'm in pain. I've always been someone uh, of um, a great pride and someone that wants to be a protector and not someone that's in need. Uh, and and pain in my books makes me appear to be needy. So, um, you know. I, I try not to walk with my cane all the time. I, I try to walk upright and not appear to be, uh, you know, in, in discomfort. It's, it's just, it's just to me, it's, it's humiliating. So I, 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 I walk as upright and as strong as I can every day, but some days are harder than others. But when you make those kinds of comments to someone, yes, I'm overweight. Absolutely. Uh, does my weight have anything to do with my disease? Absolutely not. Um, for the most part, my body's killing itself. So perhaps the more of me there is, the longer it'll take. But, you know, have a little bit of compassion for your fellow man and, and understand that some diseases, some handicaps are not visible. And that sometimes uh, those kinds of words that you used, uh, the biggest trigger for me and most lupus sufferers is stress. And, uh, you know, as I was trying to walk into the grocery store to uh, get my uh, groceries, you know, I, it just felt like the entire time I was in there that everybody was staring at me, um, probably thinking the same thing you were saying. They weren't, um, but that's how I felt. And by the time I got home, the stress had gotten so bad that I was unable to eat last night. Um, and, you know, I've been up pretty much all night trying to uh, to get the pain to subside. So have a little bit of compassion for people. Perhaps keep your opinions to yourself unless you actually know that someone's abusing the handicap parking pass. And know that, you know, there are people out there that do uh, a lot for their fellow man and a lot for their communities and don't take advantage of uh, things like a parking pass. And... It was pretty embarrassing for me to get that pass, and it hurts every time I pull that 
sun visor down to display it. And now I'm going to find myself struggling even more to use it for fear that someone like yourself will uh, take another run at me. Um, you know, and it's, it's truly not fair. You know, could I have engaged you yesterday? Could I have uh, yelled back, explained? Sure, I could have. But you know what? It, it wasn't worth it because you weren't worth it. Because I knew in my heart that you were wrong and that it, you were saying and doing something that you shouldn't. Um, love your fellow man and God bless you. Uh, I, I, you know, I don't hold any ill will against you. I just hope that you get a chance to see this video and understand that, you know, that big fat pig that you've seen um, had the right to park in that spot. Okay, God bless.